No, I am not suggesting that the boy doesn't want to go into the army. It's just that. Uh, no, no. Well, well, it seemed to me that. Uh, well, I wasn't trying to. Two weeks from today, at the adaption center, he'll be there.
guarantee. And as soon as I'm out of the right, I'll dissolve the company and go back to the academic life. After you are. Of course, it, it may take a while. But I'm sure by 1973, or 74, at the latest, it'll... What's that? Something that's going to push that date up a few years. Pick a name. Pick what name? What are you talking about? Never mind, I'll do it for you. Mac. Kim Mac. Age 15. President, Recording Secretary, Conrad Birdie Fan Club, number 2748. Sweet Apple, Ohio. Mary, would you get me Sweet Apple? The number is capital 78820. Call me right back. Now, now wait a minute. What's going on? Who's Kim? Whatever her name is. Kim McAfee, Albert. This book's going to send you back to college with the biggest hit song this business has ever seen. It's called One Last Kiss. I've never heard of it. We haven't written it. But when you do, and when that one last kiss is from Conrad Hurd, before he goes into the cold, dark army for two long years, and when he gives that kiss to one of his fans, chosen at random from 1,200,000 hysterical teenagers, why, it'll make Mr. Birdie the hottest silver since Joan of Arc. Rose! I'm beginning to see it. We'll cut the record here in New York. Take that greasy bongo playing your thief to Sweet Apple. Let him kiss the kid. And release the record. Oh, Albert, you're making enough money to stay in college the rest of your life. Gross is funny. As soon as this thing's settled, it'll just be the two of us, Rose. Perfect bliss. I'll get a job teaching English and... Bliss! Kiss! That rhymes! I wonder if anybody's ever used it before. Now, what difference is made? It'll be great for the song. Oh, one last kiss. It gives so much bliss. What is your dentifrice? <laughs> 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 <laughs>